Next question says, um, what should you do when you forget to say inshallah? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has told us in the Quran Surah Al-Kaf and do not say anything إِنِّي فَاعِلٌ ذَلِكَ غَدًا إِلَّا إِنْ يَشَاءَ Okay, it says, إِنَّا إِنْ شَاءَ Allah, it says, do not say anything that I'm going to do this and that tomorrow unless Allah wills. So therefore, saying inshallah is from the most important Islamic etiquettes whereas you realize that Allah is in control, Allah is in power وَمَا تَشَاءُونَ إِلَّا إِنْ شَاءَ اللَّهُ رَبُّ الْعَالَمِينَ Allah says, and you cannot will, you cannot wish to do anything unless it is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's will. So therefore, for the slave to understand this and to realize this and to say this is a very good thing in Islam. If you forget, ask Allah to forgive you. Ask Allah to make you firm. Seek refuge in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. For indeed, the devil is one who causes slaves to forget. As Al-Khadir alayhi salatu wasalam said to Musa alayhi salatu wasalam, he says, وَمَا أَنْسَانِي إِلَّا الشَّيْطَانُ أَنْ أَذْكُرَ he says, and the only thing that caused me to forget the fish when we were back there was the devil. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows best.